You can use EFT to install positives, positive tapping. The way to do this is to identify the problem state in just the usual way. So, for example, we might say, even though I feel anxious while tapping the karate chop point. And then in the normal course of things, we would say, even though I feel anxious, I deeply and completely accept myself. An alternative way to work with the tapping is to substitute I choose and then stating a positive that expresses what we would prefer rather than the state of anxiety in this example. So we may end up with a setup statement that goes like this. Even though I feel anxious about that interview, I choose to feel calm and confident. Even though I feel anxious about that interview, I choose to feel calm and confident. Even though I feel anxious about that interview, I choose to feel calm and confident. Then we'll continue the tapping sequence and if we have a high intensity of anxiety in the first place, which you'll have rated on your 0 to 10 scale, the best thing to do first is to focus on the negative, this anxiety, this anxiety about the interview, this anxiety about the interview, this anxiety about the interview. I feel anxious about the interview. This anxiety about the interview. This anxiety about the interview. This anxiety about the interview. And then at this point, carry on straight away with the positive statement, which was, I choose to feel calm and confident. I choose to feel calm and confident. I choose to feel calm and confident. Tapping each of the points, I choose to feel calm and confident. 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 And then at this point, we continue with the negative statement. I feel anxious about the interview, followed immediately by the positive statement. I choose to feel calm and confident. I feel anxious about the interview. I choose to feel calm and confident. Anxious about the interview. I choose to feel calm and confident. Anxious about the interview. I choose to feel calm and confident. And then take a deep breath at that point. So you've begun with your setup statement, which is the problem linked to I choose. And in this example, we chose to feel calm and confident. Then we've done one round focusing on the negative, immediately followed by another round focusing on the positive statement. I choose to feel calm and confident. And then we've immediately followed that with a round alternating. The important thing beginning with the negative on the eyebrow point, the anxiety about the interview, then followed by the positive, I choose to feel calm and confident so that we end up on the top of the head with I choose to feel calm and confident. That's important that you begin with the negative on the eyebrow and you end up with the positive on the top of the head point. I choose to feel calm and confident. In this way, whenever we go to think about the negative, anxious about the interview, our brain immediately links to the positive, I choose to feel calm and confident. And this will work with whatever examples of the negative, the problem state, and the positive that you put together linking with I choose. I choose to feel calm and confident is a useful default phrase to use in most kinds of experiences. But the principles are exactly the same, whatever you decide that it is that you want for yourself.